Jim Bass Cars and Trucks. Well, goodbye winter and hello spring. I know not, a lot of us are not going to miss winter again with plenty of that snow that we saw earlier the past several months. Again, looking at today, we did start spring. We got the vernal equinox this morning at 437. So again, official start to spring, and it has been a comfortable day for us and for much of the country, in fact. There were some showers up over the Rockies and out over the Carolinas, but for us here in the Concho Valley, relatively clear skies. Again, a very nice day for anyone getting out and about enjoying those uh, again those pleasant weekend again temperatures right now have cooled off in the 50s 55 right now still a little dry the two points in the 30s but those southeasterly winds about eight miles per hour so again a comfortable day we'll expect that to continue into tomorrow as well temperatures across the area still looking at mostly into the 50s some upper six some lower 60s rather in our southern counties 60 in el dorado 61 in sonora 58 in junction so again we're cooling off we'll continue that as we go through the overnight hours but and temperature-wise, pretty comfortable for this time of year. Much cooler off towards our eastern parts. Again, we'll walk along the Louisiana border. That's because they had some of that enduring cloud coverage over parts of the area. So again, we've stayed relatively warm, and that then allowed us to warm up through the afternoon. Winds pretty calm. Again, a gentle relief compared to what we saw uh, several days with those breezier conditions. So again, only in the single digits, but we will look for those winds to pick up just a little bit for us tomorrow. Tonight, temperature is dipping into the mid-40s. 44, clear and cool, and again, those light southeasterly winds. But if you didn't get out and enjoy uh, the pleasant weather. Maybe you took some time to watch some basketball. So again, thought I'd show you some of my picks with our basketball forecast. Again, I think the coming out with the number one seed, probably going to see sunny skies for us tomorrow. Southeasterly winds, I think they have a good strong program. They're probably going to hang on for Sunday as well. Temperature wise, I think I think 76 got a chance to do it. They got a good run. They've been warming up lately. And again, for our overnight lows, I think Good 56 could also be in store. So, again, your Sunday forecast, your bracket cast, if you're planning to stay in, this is what you'll be missing if you're staying in and watching some basketball. But again, we'll be looking for some clear skies to continue through the weekend. And as we get into the work week, then we'll start to see this low pressure system bring us some rain chances for Monday. And then another one comes through on Wednesday, brings us rain chances as well as some cooler temperatures by the middle of the week. So looking at those rain chances as we go into your Monday, again, spotty showers, not a complete washout. Everyone will be seeing some of that cloud coverage, but again, an isolated shower or even some rumbles of thunder as we go through Monday afternoon. Things will clear out going into Tuesday, and then we'll watch for another chance for it again on Wednesday. So again, looking at your extended forecast, again, we'll have another day of this great weather. Again, Sunday looks pretty nice. Then we have those rain chances for us on Monday, but the temperatures don't change that much. We're really watching for the colder air to arrive on Wednesday. That drops us back into the 60s.